For today, I'm back on Warzone, and this time with the ROG Ally. I'll be playing the 1080p at the low settings. We'll be up with that. There we go. So yeah, last time on Urzikstan, we had a bad time on the Ally. The game was stuttering, lagging. It was a mess. So I'm back here again, almost a year later. And let's see how we go this time. I can't lie though, this is feeling way better. In the warm-up, near 60, and... The stutters aren't as bad as before. It is still happening, unfortunately, but yeah, last time the game was freezing, I'm pretty sure as well, so I think it's doing better. Okay, the stutters are still pretty bad, actually. It's happening every two seconds, or even a second. Maybe it hasn't improved. But yeah, I think FSR might help with this. Oh yeah, it's definitely freezing as well. Hmm. Targets are up. Go take them down. That is definitely unfortunate. I do want to see how this runs on the Ally X, because I think the issue is probably our memory. In saying that, on Rebirth Island, it does do far better, so if you want to play Warzone, then play Rebirth. Stable 60, and the stutters are definitely far better, and it doesn't happen as often. Ooh, M16. This looks nice. But yeah, for BO6, we are getting Verdansk back, which is awesome. Going back to 2019, 2020. Because to be honest, these new maps just aren't it. The only good one is Rebirth from BO4. So all the new maps have been pretty mid. Okay, yeah, at this point, the game isn't really playable, to be honest. The game is just stuttering far too much for me. I'm going to pause it here, enable FSR 1, and see how we go. At FSR 1, add the quality preset. Apply it. FPS is now in the 70s, the high 70s. Let's see how we go with the stutters, though. Yeah, not really. Hmm, let's see. It is still stuttering. I think next I will do a 60 FPS cap as well and see if that will help us out at all. A small channel update, but I might do a few console videos for the PS3 and the 360. I think it'll be fun to go back and check out. How games ran on each console because on the ps3 there are some games that just run at 20 fps at best so yeah i think it'll be fun all right i'm gonna go ahead and pause it here guys and let's go to graphics and so i've gone ahead and lowered the vram limit to 60 percent and now we're using variable rate shading as well which should hopefully help with the hitches great start and the status, to be honest, aren't really improved. So I think this might be a bust, to be honest. Might have to just leave and play in 100p instead. Unfortunate, really. Let's see how we go here. It's gulag time. I die here, to be honest. I don't know. Well, that's weird. I survived. Didn't shoot the guy, but I'm out. Yeah, I don't know, guys. At 1080p, this is the same as before. Just stutters, you know? Just how it is. At times, it's pretty good and playable, but in other areas, it just lags way too much. So let's back out, play on 100p, and see it again. It's pretty funny how it was on 2. As far as I know, it was playable on the Steam Deck. And we just froze. We just froze. Rejoin the match. But yeah, I was saying, it's pretty funny how Warzone 2 was playable on the Steam Deck at 60 FPS, or near 60 FPS, but Warzone 3, which is on the same engine and looks the same and plays most of the same, is just having a hard time now. And if you go back to Warzone 1, even worse, because back then you could play the game at 60 FPS on an older machine from like 2014, 2015. But nowadays, yeah, it is a pain. All right, guys, no 100p, no FSR, 60 FPS. The stutters still here. And yeah, there we go. It is back to stuttering like before. Every half a second, pretty much. <sighs> so yeah, it's pretty inconsistent at times. It does play well, and others, it is just a mess. 
It sucks, but I think on the Ally X, it will do better. That's my guess. And for the fun of it, let's go ahead and play at 720p as well while we're here. That will help us out, but let's just see anyway. Yep. So far, pretty similar, guys. Not really surprised, though. The game is a stuttery mess like it was like seven months ago, six months ago. So yeah, that is Warzone Uzbekistan revisited on the ROG Ally. If you guys enjoyed, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time, next video. See you guys then.